This video is super overdue, but there's been so much stuff happening within the Gypsy community that I need to update you guys on. And last time I got a lot of complaints about how the text was too short and it was hard for people to read. So for this video, I'm going to do a voiceover and you guys let me know which one you like better. Anyways, let's jump into all the tea. So if you ever watched Gypsy Sisters, you obviously know who this is. This is Nettie Stanley and she was basically like the matriarch of the family. She ran everything. She has nine kids and she was really mouthy on the show. She didn't really take anyone's shit. But nowadays, she keeps a really low-key life, she stays out of drama, she barely talks to anyone, including some of her sisters. All she really focuses on is being with her family, raising the kids that are still living with her, and she has a really active relationship with a lot of her grandchildren as well. Dallas is Nettie's oldest daughter, and she recently just had her fifth child, which was a little boy that she named Archie. She's no longer with the baby's father. Her most popular relationship was probably the one that was featured on the show, which was with a man named Jay, and she has three of her children with him, and weirdly, at one point, he turned to dating Annie, which is Nettie's cousin. But they have since broke up, and now Jay is dating Amber, who was a girl on My Big Fat American Gypsy Wedding. She married a man named Tommy on the show. Next up is Nucky, and she's another one of Nettie's daughters. She was the one who was 14 years old and ran away with her boyfriend Pookie on the show, and Nettie tried to hunt her down to find her. They kind of have a rocky relationship because they argue a lot, and Pookie was known to cheat on her a lot. However, they have three children together. During one of their breakups, Nucky decided that she was going to get married to a new man named Jonas, and this boy was introduced to her by her sister Dallas. Dallas knew him for whatever reason, and there's pictures of him in previous like family pictures, so I guess he was a friend of the family. At the beginning of April, it was announced that Jonas passed away in a tragic car accident, and Dallas was really distraught over it. She posted all over her Facebook about it. Well, pretty much everyone in the Gypsy community did. It was a really sad day. But Nucky never really married Jonas. She realized at the last minute that she wanted to be with Pookie, so she backed out of the wedding and went back to him. But recently it's been suspected that her and Pookie have broken up once again and that she's back living at her mom's because she's posting a lot of pictures and videos with Nettie, but this is not confirmed. Next is Kayla, which is Nettie's cousin, and she was also featured on Gypsy Sisters. Not only that, but she was the one that got any physical altercation with Nettie. So if you've kept up with Kayla at all, you know that she divorced her husband Richard, who was featured on the show with her, and married a new man named Benny Small. And they've been married for a while now, but at some point they broke up for a little bit. I don't know why, but they ultimately ended up back together, so it doesn't matter. A lot of people began to come for Kayla and her husband because Kayla allowed her 14-year-old daughter Lexi to date her stepbrother, Benny Small Jr. So I mean, yeah, obviously it's weird when step-siblings are dating, but people began to attack Kayla even more when they found out that Lexi was 14 and Benny was 19 or 20. I'm not sure exactly on his age, but people were upset with that. Lexi is no longer with Benny, but the simple fact that that was even allowed to happen has a lot of people questioning their morals. Next is Sissy, and that is another one of Kayla's daughters, and this is probably the update that a lot of you have been looking forward to because there was a lot of controversy connected to what happened to one of Sissy's sons, Henry Ace. But just to recap on what happened, Henry Ace was placed into a really, really hot bathtub. The story was that Bruce's daughter from a previous relationship accidentally put him in there when it was too hot, but there were so many people saying they thought Sissy did it on purpose or just someone did it on purpose. So Sissy briefly lost custody of, I don't know of both of her boys, but I know she definitely did for Henry Ace due to all the speculation as to what really happened to him and there needed to be an investigation done to really ensure that this was an accident. Fortunately, since the incident, Henry Ace has made a full recovery and I believe the investigation has been completed and they ruled that it was an accident because Sissy has custody of her children again and there were pictures posted from Easter 
where she has both of her boys together. She is still with her husband, Bruce, and they recently just had an exciting announcement saying that they are expecting their third child together, and Sissy said that she's definitely pulling for a girl this time. So this is Danielle, which is Kayla's oldest daughter, and she married the man in this picture, George, and they have a little girl together named Janie. During my last update video, I explained that Danielle and her husband were having a really hard time trying to get pregnant again. They would have like false positive tests and she was really frustrated about it. But, surprise, she is about six to seven months pregnant now with another girl she's naming Lavada. Now we have Annie, who is Kayla's sister and Nettie's cousin. And I briefly mentioned her in the beginning when I said that she started dating Dallas's ex-husband and baby daddy, Jay. Them being together caused a lot of drama in the family because obviously it's disrespectful, number one, but number two, Jay would literally bounce back and forth between the two girls, so they were constantly arguing over him. But that relationship didn't work out after a couple years, and Annie started dating a man named Huey. And catch this part. Huey is Melly's ex, and we'll jump into Melly's update next, but Melly is Nettie's sister, so they keep a lot within the family. When Melly found out that Annie was dating her ex-boyfriend, she really didn't even care, and I kind of respect her for that because Melly is a known fighter. She's a known loud mouth and she has a short temper. So I'm really shocked that she didn't care. But at the same time, I feel like that's because she's really occupied with what's going on within her own life right now. So let's talk about Melly. Melly met a man named MJ West and they got engaged. And to my knowledge, they're still engaged. However, like I've also seen people claim that they're married. So it's a really confusing situation, but they're also on and off a lot. So Melly has three kids and she she has custody of two of them and her daughter Brandy lives with her father. However, once she met MJ, she fell pregnant again with her fourth child. She found out she was having a girl and she decided to name her Serenity Faye and she recently gave birth to her. This update is a little shocking for me to make. This is Dubby, which is Melly and Nettie's sister, and she was featured on the show a couple times, but she was also portrayed as the really chill sister. She kind of distanced herself from the gypsy lifestyle and she lived away from everyone, so I really liked her. I liked how she was independent and she was doing her own thing. She even dated a girl at one period and I was like, go girl, like yes, this is unheard of in the gypsy community. Like I feel like everyone would probably be assholes towards something like that and Dubby branched out from that. However, it has come to light that she is now with Robbie, which is Melly's first baby daddy and the father of Richie, which is her first son. Like I said, I guess they just keep it in the family, but I'm just shocked that this is coming from Dovey because she was such an independent person who seemed like she didn't want to be caught up in that cycle, but whatever. And while doing my research, I uncovered that Robbie messed with Dallas, which is Nettie's daughter, a couple years back as well. So what is going on? This is Tanya, who is another one of the sisters to Dovey, Melly, and Nettie. And I don't really have any updates on her, but I do have updates on her daughters. So this is Savannah, who is Tanya's oldest daughter. And this is her husband, Austin. They have a daughter together named Charlotte, and they recently just welcomed their second daughter, Lila Jane, to the mix. This is Raquel, who is Tanya's second oldest daughter, and she recently met her boyfriend, Nick, and they fell in love and decided that they were going to get married. So she had her wedding a couple months ago and I thought her wedding pictures were super cute. She's a beautiful bride. This is Jackie D and she's Pookie's little sister. She's been on a couple episodes of My Big Fat American Gypsy Wedding. But after the show, Jackie found love with a boy named Chasen and they decided to get married. And a little bit after that, Jackie found out that she was pregnant with a boy that she was going to name Giovanni Gray. She recently had him and she looks like she's just doing great with motherhood so I'm really happy for her. She's also staying really close with Nucky which I respect 
because even though her and Pookie are having their ups and downs, it seems like they're trying to put family first. Last update I did, people were asking for an update on Joanne because I didn't really touch on her that much. So I'm going to try to in this video, but there really isn't that much to update with when it comes to her. She met a new man, she fell in love, his name's Terry, and they got married. She's happy, she's just living her life, and she's really low-key on social media as well. So those are all of the important updates that I have in all of the tea. Thank you guys so much for watching. Like and leave a comment.